what is up everybody so today we're going to be checking out how i do the mission extradition in grand theft auto 5. all right so where is my car where's your car dude heading over here i think i got a bike over here and i got a seven thousand dollar bounty on me why all right so we got a little sanchez over here we'll take that turn the radio off all right, so what I normally will do first is I'll go ahead and order my chopper. I think I got a buzzard or something like that. Ooh, Hello, Pegasus. Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help you? Thank you, sir. Your spectacular aircraft is now ready for you at our nearest airfield. Is that our GPS for the Pegasus vehicle? Oh, he tried to get me right there. Chill out. Oh, driving skills. Oh, driving skills. I hate driving through this neighborhood, though. Like, this neighborhood is so toxic when it comes to driving. All the turns and curves. Oh, driving skills. Oh, driving skills. Come on. Why are they parked in the middle of the street that way? I just realized like they were just sitting there talking like, yo, what you eat for breakfast? I don't know. Get out of the street. Watch out. Why did they send my... Oh. I just realized I wasn't going towards the chopper. I was going towards the destination. All right. Took us on a wild little run there. So we're gonna take this over to Fort Zancundo. All right, so when you get close to the fort, you want to look for like this sort of tower with like this red and white striping on the side. So right here in front of us is that's the tower that we're talking about. You wanna to come to that building that's right next to that tower and you wanna land your chopper roughly around this area here. Yeah, about right here is fine. You're gonna get out. Like I said, that's the sort of tower that you wanna see. I think it's like a communications tower or something like that. You wanna come roughly around here. You wanna be lined up with sort of like the corner of this wall here. And you're gonna look straight ahead. So once you trigger this mission, they're gonna want you to stop this plane because that's the plane that the DEA agent is on. We're gonna aim roughly around here, right, just right above the gate. And you're gonna shoot your grenade launcher over there. It's gonna blow up that plane. So before we do that, we're gonna actually go to our map, find that pinpoint that we had, and we're gonna set our waypoint there so we can at least see that blip on the, on the radar. And then we'll head towards that. As soon as we blow that up and trigger the mission, we'll head straight there. So about right here, just above that. Bingo. And you're gonna head straight to the chopper. We're gonna come in and try to trigger the mission. Okay, triggered it. All right, now we can get out of here without our plane getting torn to crap. We're gonna go ahead and call Lester. They did a lot more damage than I was warning them to do. Fine, we're gonna call Lester and get their stars How can I be of service? Okay, Good. so you're in serious trouble and you need my help. Where's that blip on the radar? Recheck that. They should have taken it away. All right, almost uh -huh. got body there. We might not make it all the way there by this chopper, but at least we'll get most of that way that we need to get. But even doing it this way is much easier. All right, so we got a bail. There we go. Took you guys long enough. And we're like pretty much right down the street from it. All right, so we are here. This is the destination here. He's gonna be pulling into this lot, this door here. So we're gonna set up a sticky bomb. Set it up right there. 
Let's see where he's at. Okay, so he's actually close by. I want to set it up to where when it when it explodes, we can pull up, grab it, and hop right back into the vehicle. When we get back into the vehicle, we're going to take this railroad and we're going to try to see if we can hide and duck off there. So you can see the limo down the street coming. And I think to deploy the weapon is right or left. You can go. There go the briefcase. Pull up. Grab it. Back in the car. And we're out of here. And we're going to come down here before a lot of officers really get a visual on us. We'll come about right here. Hopefully they don't get too wise on me and come down this way. If we see lights, we'll go ahead and head out of here. Come on, let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and call Lester. Actually, we may not need to call Lester. Hold on. We might be able to shake these guys. And we did. Good stuff. We're gonna grab our helicopter. They set it on top of the medical building. And we wanna fly the rest of the way to the destination. And. They come to your destination. This is all on top of Martin Madrazo's. And you're done. Really simple. Brilliant, brilliant, really easy. Brilliant. And I want to say this mission way. should pay you about 21000 So that's not too bad. But this is just showing how I normally do my me. Oh, okay. Pay the 17 that's nice but that is it for this video you guys that is the way i normally do my extradition mission for gta 5 like comment share subscribe and i may be doing some more videos like these if you guys like these until next time guys i'll see you soon peace